want to not be on my team. Pajamas, or I should just say this pajama shirt in general. So comfortable. Alright, I got this really cute picture frame that was part of Easter decor. And look how cute. I didn't notice the little chip on there when I got it, but that's okay. And I just put my graduation picture. And that's my friend Jalisa. This like little section of my room is looking very nice and east and springish. Now I still have like some Easter decor, like this little bunny, but I'm just gonna keep it for spring. And then as you go down, y'all can see like all the other stuff. But yeah, I'm obsessed. All right, guys, I kind of just threw on some clothes so that I can go help my mom run some errands for my grandma, which I basically was planning to do anyways. But let me show y'all. My outfit today is just like, it's honestly kind of like, what is she wearing? <laughs> All right. And I put on these little purple cloud earrings. Now, we're also going to use this little mug. I just need to finish washing it. It comes with two straws. One is plastic and one is glass. Which is nice so that, you know, you don't have to use the glass straw because glass straws just have a tendency to break. wash your tumblers before using them. Sorry, my mom is calling me. I missed her call. This mug is so cute though. I gotta get some like drinks to drink in it. Oh, I almost forgot to wash the lid, guys. Y'all, I can't find my car keys. You know, an essential thing I need to drive my car, which means I either walk them in my car, which I left my keys in my car. Oh, oh. That's not good, but I don't usually do that. Alright, I'm about to meet my mom at the store to help get stuff for my grandma. I need to get my water bottle. One sec. Alright, I feel very colorful today. Honestly, I feel like an elementary school teacher. <laughs> My outfit today is just like, it's so random that it's like cute. My style is, is questionable some days. Not
not gonna lie there's certain days i feel like i'm dressed cuter than others but some days i just throw on clothes and get out the door and don't stress about it other days i actually you know try and put the effort in today was the former all right i also did not have time to put on any sort of makeup but we need some lip balm I've been in like a content creating mood lately, so I've been editing videos like a storm. I need to still edit my weekend vlog for last weekend. All right guys, so basically the stuff I was gonna get for my grandma, my mom just got for her. And basically I just picked up the items and I'm dropping it off for my grandma since my mom has to go pick up her medicine on the base so my mom does a lot for my grandma like she drives down here like once a week just to like get her stuff and I like help 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 a lot but I can't do like stuff on base my mom did add me to the, her Sam's Club membership um, basically just so I could um, do errands, help with errands for my grandma. Like she likes the Sam's chicken, which I have gotten for her, picked up one of those for her before. But yeah, oh, the rotisserie chicken, that's what it is. Um, but after this, I needed to go to Walmart, uh, Five Below, Dollar Tree and Aldi and it's 10 a.m. now so I want to be done with all of my errands by 12 and then relax for a little bit until I have to go to work at 2.45. Honestly, I might try to take, my, um, take a nap because I also feel kind of tired. I didn't really write down like good grocery list right now. The only thing on my list is like milk, bread, and there's one more thing. So I do need to get like some actual groceries because I haven't been cooking. Like I have stuff to make sandwiches, I just don't have bread so I haven't been making sandwiches. All right, y'all know something crazy? I feel like they don't make all brick houses anymore. Like, I remember when, <coughs> like, I feel like all of the newer houses are all like that sidewall, like that cheap sidewall stuff. I'm like, what happened to all brick buildings? Well, honestly, I know brick is super expensive. So a lot of people can't, can't afford to buy, buy it. All right, I'm about to try this gas station and see if I can find um, this like limited edition flavor poppy. Cause some gas stations have it, it's just like hard. I never see it at like Walmart or Target or any of those places. Y'all, it stinks so bad in this restroom. It smells like someone was chain smoking cigarettes. Ugh, I'm about to throw up. All right, let's see if I see it. Y'all, I turned very badly. Oh, 
Oh, Hi, um, can I do a small um, Oreo ice cap? Okay, small Oreo ice cap. Um, and can I do the sausage English McMuffin? Um, I can do a hash brown, I guess. Okay. What else can we get for you? Um, that's it. All right. 827. See you in the window. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't even realize they had combos. I learned something new today. Should have gotten a donut. <laughs> um. What happened to the whipped cream on top? Did it run out of whipped cream on top? Well, we only put a little dab. Oh. Yeah. We only a little dab. Have a good day. Thank you. Y'all, my drink looks so sad. I was like, what is this? They put a tiny squirt of whipped cream and she's like, it only comes with that. I'm like, well, that's not what the picture looks like. I'm so confused about that. It doesn't even look, look like the picture. I feel like when it first opened, I feel like they offered a lot better, had a lot better options than they do now. Now it just seems like they just throw things all willy-nilly. Okay. My next stop probably should be Aldi, but since I'm getting groceries from there, I'm gonna go there last. Oh, it's already 10.30. I'm already just feeling like my errands are gonna take longer than I want and that's gonna make me upset but let's see if this is any good they're really skimpy on the whipped cream on top which I feel like is weird because I'm like whipped cream's not that expensive but It still tastes good, just doesn't look like the picture. Y'all, I don't know where I am right now. I'm on the hunt for basically this flavor poppy. That's really hard to find. The wild berry one. This hash brown is not good. I should have gotten the donut. I'm really disappointed in Tim Hortons. Like this is the first not good experience I've had. One starting with them. I don't know. I feel like they're, they gaslit me are gaslighting me with this drink by telling me it doesn't get whipped cream on top and then the hash brown wasn't good so
So I think my best bet is going to be to try um, the Fresh Market for the Poppy because I feel like they're like a healthy store and Poppy's like, I mean, they're kind of a bougier brand. Potentially Walmart could have it, but I doubt it. So we're gonna go to Walmart first. And then I also need to go to Five Below. And then we're gonna turn around and go to, honestly, I don't really wanna go to the Fresh Market though. Like, I wasn't on my plan. I already am going to four stores. And I feel like that's just like an extra store that I can go to tomorrow. So for now, we're just going to go to Walmart and Five Below. <sighs> I barely want to go to Aldi. I do really want to go to, I did really want to go to Dollar Tree, but the Dollar Tree I want to go to is by my house. And like the time it takes to, I never take into account like the time it actually takes to run. <coughs> Sorry. To drive places too. So I want to be done by 12 and it's already like 10.30. Alright, I got a sausage meat muffin. Yeah. This just tastes okay. Like, I don't know. Tim Hortons is not hitting the way it used to for me. So sad. hurt my foot somehow like my toes hurt when I walk I just don't know how or when but they've been hurting for a minute okay I'm in Sam's Club guys <coughs> um, I just feel like sometimes they sell Um, interesting things, so we're gonna look. All right, they have these variety pack poppies, but they're not the flavors I want or like. All right, this is all I've gotten so far. And then maybe some salad. I'm gonna get my one thing and leave. I've been here too long. All right, I'm done at Sam's. Now we go to Walmart and then Five Below. And I'm probably not gonna go to Aldi today, guys. I just don't have the energy in me. But I'll just go to Dollar Tree. Y'all, my brain just flipped and I got so lost for a second going the wrong direction because this store is opposite so like than the one I usually go to oh my goodness I found these little drinks My goodness, guys. It's already 11.30. All right, guys, I'm finally done at five below. I found most of what I needed. And then the only thing I haven't been able to find is the film for these little cameras I got. And if I can't find it, I might have to return them because, you know, I really wanted, wanted some like film cameras.
cameras to take like cute pictures. I use it mainly like when I travel, kind of in place of like a Polaroid camera. But because I haven't been able to find the film for it at Five Below, I can't use them. So there's one another Five Below I can try to find it at. But so far the two I've been to, they haven't had it. I am going to go to Dollar Tree since I'm already out very, very quickly and then go home and take a nap. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. This is one of my favorite Dollar Trees, so hopefully they have some good stuff. They finally have my favorite ocean water drink mix. I attempted to take a nap today guys it just didn't happen but I did put on these nails I got from Dollar Tree they're really cute and we're still drinking our Olipop I just put it in this little container much new makeup and stuff I need to organize same over here this looks kind of bad right now but I will be organizing everything over here guys I am really trying to be more organized so that it's not so, everything doesn't look so cluttered as long as it's organized. April 8th is like the scheduled date of this eclipse and there's been like a lot of people talking about how you know this is a sign I feel like I've seen an eclipse then because like I've seen the sky look like this before a while ago I just like maybe wasn't super sure what it what was going on but yeah it's just like weird like it's sunny but dark outside right now Honestly, I haven't really been paying attention to like everything about the eclipse because I'm just like It's another day, you know, there's people who are like, oh doomsday It's the day the world ends and all of that stuff where Jesus is coming back, which Jesus is coming back, but No one knows the exact day. So like if someone's saying they know when Jesus is coming back They are not telling the truth um, But yeah I forgot that that was happening today. I'm headed to my session with my client. I decided to film like a little mini TikTok vlog of that. Just like what that looks like for me. Honestly though, it's pretty, pretty boring, not gonna lie. Not because, um, like what I do is boring it's just like I can't like show or film or really to even talk about my client sessions because of like HIPAA laws so I can only really show myself like what I bring to work what I wear to work 
and that type of stuff which we got our water of course I did pack snacks today and I've been using this adorable little tote with this like Hawaiian Hello Kitty um, keychain on it this has been my bag for the past couple of days um, but yeah it's just kind of like my sessions when I am headed or do I have my sessions with my client like I can't really film or talk about them so I feel like I can't really show it much except for like me driving there and me after gotta go see what is all the packages my dad's upset about oh, I only thought I was getting three packages today it did look like a lot all right let me check okay guys I don't know what some y'all I just got a letter to a Zoom court meeting. For quote unquote following too closely from February 23rd of 2019. So something that happened five years ago. It's crazy. It's a hybrid hearing. I thought this was dismissed because I never heard anything back about it. Citation only. I don't know how I register for the virtual one. <sighs> well, that sucks. Y'all, I swear, like, everything always happens at the worst time. So now, <sighs> my goodness.
to film a haul video from the packages I got yesterday because <sighs> I didn't film it yesterday. I was literally about to like jump ship, so. <laughs> Y'all, I'm so dramatic. I literally started packing my suitcase because I thought this is a, it's this is it. My dad's about to kick me out for real. But again, I was just being dramatic. Anyways, um, the main thing. It's really just two packages because the other two are like Amazon stuff. So that's what I need to show you guys. Go check out my vlog, um, my second channel if you want to see. All right, guys. So there's like a lot of stuff I want to get done today. And I've also been filming and editing a lot of content the past couple of days but there's a lot on my mind right now um so um, for today I need well one I'm supposed to be getting like a bunch of packages today I think probably like two or three and then there's like five packages I'm waiting for. So my spending has gotten out of control this past week. Like, I don't know what it is. It's like, as soon as I tell myself, I don't want to spend money is when my, I'm like, I want to spend money. But really it's just like the online shopping. Honestly, it's just shopping in general. So we are not going to be purchasing any more things for the time being because I really do have enough things and even though I enjoy shopping and making haul videos it's just like I have too much stuff and it's also affecting like my dad got upset because I had like a bunch of packages come yesterday and you know I wasn't expecting to have so many different packages in one day but I also just need to refocus on oh, paying off, or not paying off, saving my money, so it's probably for the best. But I am excited for the things that I do did get because I got some really good organization things, and my content moving forward is going to be more like daily life and like collections videos organization videos declutter videos so for people who enjoy those types of videos that's gonna be what i'm focusing on and also like empties like using the things i already have so that is our focus moving forward um and then again like there's a lot of things i definitely need to get rid of um as well so yeah
I got some more packages. This was the packages that I was like, I told my dad I was expecting because I knew he would be upset. But I still have y'all four more packages. Smaller ones, but still four more. Um, two, three of them are coming to the house and the other one I, I sent to my grandma's. All right, guys, we just put some nails on. Look how pretty they turned out. I'm obsessed. Anytime I do nails, I feel like really bougie. All right, guys, I've already lost all of the freaking nails. Well, not on this hand. On this hand that I just put on. So the press ones I've been using have been like the... They're like pre-glued and those suck. Those never stick long. I have to have ones that at least I'm putting nail glue on. But I need to invest in some good quality nail glue. I feel like the only places I can find the good stuff is probably like the beauty supply store. Anyways, I just filmed a haul video of all of this stuff. Um, My room, shockingly. So... I feel like my room's looking like cleaner right now than usual. Um, I also got a new utility cart from Amazon that will be linked in my Amazon storefront. It's super cute and look how much stuff it holds. So this isn't how I'm going to keep it. This is just what I put in it for now, but it holds like a bunch of stuff. Um, and I feel like it fits nicely. I can also like turn it. It's a rolling one, so I probably will keep it in my room like this so that it looks, I don't know, does that look better or worse? To me, that's better, but to each their own. Well, I am freaking exhausted. I had a full day of content creation and I pretty much probably made at least six or seven videos including actually more than that if i include all of the tiktok videos but i got a lot of stuff done we filmed a couple of hauls we also were able to put together some new storage organizers i got a new ring light also that i have been using and loving i also currently put um turned on my little hello kitty um, light. I need to start using like all of these little neon signs that I have. They're battery operated so it's not like I'm draining um, power or using up my dad's energy when I turn these on. So I have three currently hanging up. I used to have like five or six <coughs> that I took down. I'm looking around my room right now though and I'm just like super happy and super content with like everything right now exactly how it is which i know for a lot of people it's like i have so much stuff you have too much stuff you have you know more stuff than anyone could possibly need and yes you are correct <laughs> i do still have um way more stuff than the average person but for me this is just like a manageable amount of stuff like where i don't feel overwhelmed by all of this I understand that for some people, the amount of stuff I have would be overwhelming. For me, this is like manageable. So I have um, enough organizers to now finally put stuff the way I want it. I also do think like for this, because this is like a, my vanity desk is not technically a real vanity. It's a portable desk that my mom let me borrow and I just never gave back. So. I do actually want to eventually invest in a nice vanity for all of my stuff that has like lots of storage and then I also think like this area would not look as overwhelming as it currently does and same for like these smaller bookcases would actually probably be in like a living room or like office. I want to get like the bigger bookcases um, that have at least five shelves on them probably two of those 
to actually um, store a bunch of like my perfume, sprays, candles, things like that, handbags, purses. Um, so I don't have things set up exactly how I would want to have it. But I really do feel like just at peace right now with everything. And even though I'm disappointed that I've been doing so much shopping the past couple of, um, honestly, like, it's been, like, weeks, but I've really only shopped, like, a couple of days. It's just, like, I buy so much on those days that it's bad. I'm about to make some leftover food. I did kind of do some intermittent fasting today accidentally on purpose like i just kind of was like well i don't want to eat until i get everything done there are still some videos i need to edit but for the most part i got everything done today i wanted to get done it's almost five o'clock so i have a full day i've been up since about what 9 a.m that's pretty much a nine to five and i didn't really take a break so this was a full day of content creation for people who think content creators don't do work we do i filmed i do also film a lot of content because i make everything content so that's just how i personally do stuff but yeah we had a full day of content creation and worked about eight hours non-stop so I'm technically not done. I filmed everything. I still have to edit a couple more videos um, and upload some videos. took a really nice <laughs> I'm sorry y'all I forgot I had taken my wig off and so I still have my wig cap on anyways I'm about to get to my Zumba class I'm running a little behind schedule because I kept snoozing my alarm I did not take a nap today like I probably would have enjoyed but I uploaded I kid you not guys nine videos on my youtube channel today i also edited and uploaded a vlog and i edited and uploaded at least five tiktok drafts so i have been very productive today which is good um so yeah I want to keep my hair. This is how I wear my hair under my wigs. And since I feel like that wig glue stuff I'm using, the wig grip stuff, is like not good for my hair. That's why I'm spraying this um, leave in conditioner. Because my wig cap will stick to my hair after. <laughs> Sorry, guys. My wig cap will stick to my hair after using that spray, which just means it's a really strong spray. Alright, I'm just going to find a cute headband to put on and call this a day. Well... I gotta figure out what to wear also i just want to say i've been loving my room a lot more recently like i just love the decor that's currently in here like all my new spring stuff my room looks like even though i feel like i've gotten more stuff it looks way more organized than it used to and that's because i've been really trying to just focus on organizing things 
the things that I currently have. Say, y'all might think it's bad, but I actually think it's perfect. <laughs> but I still do have a lot of stuff. It's just like at a level that I, I'm okay with right now. I feel like the, the most, the things that I need to go through the most is clothes. That's what I've ran out of space for honestly the most is just like my, this little cart over here is packed and then my closet is pretty packed right now too like i've had to start hanging things on here and all of these bins are like my purses um okay we're gonna look for some workout clothes and there's some in here that i have not worn okay i have this bra top and then Let's see. This is from clearance that I got. And I got this top from... I don't know which one I should wear. These both have built-in bras in it, though. I go with... <laughs> this one so this candle i've been burning cactus rose is so relaxing like it just makes my room smell so zen all right this is what i want to wear to my zumba class i'm wearing two technically sports bras but it's given a little too much babies so i think we're going to put a top on top of this because uh yeah All right, y'all, I'm running late to my class because I, did, I just wanted to keep sleeping. I was getting such a good nap in, but we're headed to the gym now. The thing is, I film a lot of, um, I get a lot of drafts or content, content, TikTok content from my haul videos. So, and also just doing like my mini vlogs and morning routine videos. Also keeps my TikTok pretty packed. So, there's always content I can film at any given time, whether it's just vlog clips, morning routine, night routine, skincare routine. Also, I feel like those are videos that I don't have to, don't cost me money. So, yeah.
court this morning. <laughs> so this is what we are wearing. My basic interview outfit that I always wear. So this does not look very nice. I did get like two I would get two different flavors which here I only got one flavor and I got the medium this time because last time I had gotten mild and it wasn't that great finally clean this mirror and look how clear I look in it now the difference it makes and I cleaned this one, and I cleaned this one, and this one. Publix haul. We got Mother's Day cakes, which are little lemon snack cakes. I got a bunch of these little Icelandic um, provisions yogurts. So I got key lime, the vanilla bean extra creamy. The peach and cloud berry. And then passion fruit and mango. Um, I found these little corn nuggets to try. 
These were only $1.80, so I was like, let's just try them. Um, also got my eight-piece mixed chicken. Publix has the best chicken. And I got this to eat with the pasta salad I made today because I didn't feel like cooking another protein. Um, I found these tea stuff shells. I got um, my favorite pizza, the Screaming Sicilian, and I got pepperoni. Also found these classic cheddars. They were buy one, get one free, so half off. And so is the pizza, y'all. So pretty much all of this, except for the cakes, was a BOGO at Publix, and except for these two. I got my Eddie Slow Trend Classic Vanilla Ice Cream. Also got some um, breast fillets. I'll probably cook um, later. I think I might put them in my freezer for now. Got some tomatoes. These are to add to my pasta salad. Um, cookie dough birthday cake cookies and then also because it was Wednesday I had to get my five dollar Wednesday sushi which is just the spicy California roll so that's everything been in a content creating frenzy for like the past um couple of days like I don't know what it is I just feel this need to like make as much content as I can and have been mainly like for my sorry guys I gotta make my bed and I don't understand why my thing is like this okay here we go um i have just literally been in a content making frenzy so i've literally been posting like content what feels like non-stop for the past however many days um i'm trying to be like organized with it though so i just have so much ideas that I want to get done and I'm just like <sighs> it's like hard for me to like schedule everything because it's so much but I think I need to start like making a calendar for like things I want to film so that I'm not wasting so much time or trying to get like five videos filmed one day <clears throat> Especially for me, like in the mornings right now, I have a little bit more free time. Um, just because I don't really have to be at work most days until after two or after two current with my current schedule. And that will change if I um, become full time. That's the first thing. And someone suggested a really good video idea, which I kind of already have been doing, uh, which was um, since I'm trying to go a month without spending, which I did kind of already fail the first couple of days, but we're just gonna try for the rest of the month. Um, and basically she said, to pretty much just do like mini vlogs every day of what I do instead of shopping, which is what I've been doing. I've been making so much content of just like my daily life, day in my life videos and like the little morning routines. I can do those like every day. Um, try to do those every day. 
And then I was also thinking about doing the day in my life videos for my vlog, vlog channel shorts. And on this one, do like my morning routine slash skincare. Cause I make a lot of like skincare videos. <sighs> Sorry guys, I'm out of breath. This is a lot right now. Okay, let's put on these pillows. I've got new Hello Kitty pillow. My bed is always like, it's never the same. I never make my bed the exact same. But there it is. All right, I also need to run some errands today. I'm about to put on the outfit I wore yesterday because I need to still shower. But I want to do my errands first and then I'm going to like actually get ready for work probably around like 1 p.m. So we're just going to put on, this is what I wore, this little Hello Kitty set and this little top. Alright, this is it but I'm just going to put on this jacket and I'm probably not going to do anything to my hair. Um, the other thing is, I have, I need to write this down. So, one, we've been trying to like journal or write things down as soon as the video idea pops into my head because if I don't, y'all, I will forget. Um, so this is my little notebook. It's for, I put that this is my Bible study one, but I've been putting like, or watch of other things I was studying in this book. Daily Life, this was today. So, I wrote down my TikTok, but I need to write down my YouTube video ideas that I need to film. And first one is a updated 2024 room tour. So that's something I've been meaning to film. Um, I do need to like finish putting up some decor I got, but that will probably be filmed this weekend. All right, let's go run some errands. I've been using this bag for like the past week or so, and it just has a cute little, I put this little Hello Kitty charm on it. So, I'm supposed to be picking up um, my Five Below. I ordered film, but I also need to return my speaker. So, let me grab that so I don't forget. Okay. Okay, this is the speaker. And I have the pink one also. And the pink one is the one we're gonna keep. Cause, I mean, they're both really cute, but I don't need both of them. I really wanted the pink one, but online they only had the red one and that's where I had ordered it first. And then I found the pink one in store, so I went ahead and bought it. So that's the reasoning behind that for those who care okay and then that is the return. okay and then i do actually have something else i need to return i bought two of the same camera so these two we gotta return Um, also, I hope you guys can tell I did clean my mirrors in my room yesterday. So now when I film in my mirrors, y'all can actually see me. And then here's this one. And then this one. This is my like walking out the door last minute check. And then I usually film like 
take my pic outfit pictures in here because I just like the background from this mirror better. But this one is like the bigger mirror that I actually should use. Alright, and we haven't eaten breakfast or anything. I probably am not going to eat breakfast till much later because I need to get groceries. I want to make like an acai bowl. So we got to have the certain things to make it. And I have the stuff to make the bowl. I just need like granola and stuff. So let's go run some errands. Okay, I feel like I need to like attempt at least to fix my hair because chow. This is not good. I mean like, it's not the worst thing in the world. It's just like, I probably should be embarrassed to leave my house looking a certain way. Most days I just am not. That's like a little bit better, but not really that much. All right, guys, I legitimately have less than two hours to run all these errands. And we're gonna try to be as strategic as possible because we don't want to waste our time driving. It's so weird, like it's rain, it's like rainy but sunny. So it was storming kind of bad last night and apparently there was a flood warning i just was not aware of it yesterday when i went to work so i was out here in a storm unbeknownst to me oh my gosh i forgot i had this really cute little portable charger in my bag also a five below fine like i i'm telling y'all i have been legitimately obsessed with five below and it's really really hard for me to not spend money when i go there but i don't feel as bad spending money there because it's also like so cheap and they just have really cute stuff like five below please sponsor sponsor me one of these days so that i will promote y'all for free I, I mean i'm already promoting y'all for free at this point Oh, anyways, guys, we're gonna try to go into Fabio. I mean, since I'm doing a return, I can exchange my items, but I can't like purchase more than what I'm exchanging. So the two items will get me like $15. Lost power again randomly 
for like another four hours like it's i don't know somebody either ha hit a line or something was damaged and no one said anything to people because it did it did not make sense to me that all of the all of these storm clouds were um or sorry the power is constantly going out in my dad's neighborhood and the last time it had gone out it was like only some of his neighborhoods power lines so i'm like somebody did something or was doing something they weren't supposed to do Guys, I went to Ulta because I had a key and I ended up picking up something. Um, and I still need to go to Aldi and Target, so that's our next stop. And I only have like an hour to finish the rest of my errands today because I still have to be at work at 2 o'clock. It's about to start raining. So I'm gonna make this as quick as possible. and I'm only getting toilet paper so that shouldn't take too long and then we're gonna head home guys this should be my easiest stop I spent 
Dollar Tree, however, I spent close to 20 bucks. And then um, Target, I actually had a gift card that I used, so that made my shop there cheaper as well. So all in all, we got everything on my list, so I'm happy. And I'm gonna go home, do a haul really quick, and then I have to get ready for work and make lunch. Also, so the really good thing about me living so close to where I work, at least when I'm doing um, center sessions versus in home, I literally have to only have to leave like five minutes before I have to be there to get there on time for my session. Um, some days I will get there a little bit earlier if I just want time to like sit and do everything. But usually I get there like as soon as I get there, I'm just ready to go and have like all of my stuff ready. But typically I don't have to leave until like five minutes before I have to be there and I'm good. Guys, I'm packing all of my groceries and I'm gonna make lunch, but I just realized I forgot I bought sushi for lunch today, so I actually already had my lunch. And then I'm gonna start getting ready at like 1.30, which will give me a good 25 minutes. So yeah. Um, actually, let me just go ahead and show y'all what I got from Aldi. Cause this is all the groceries I got today. So, we got some crunchy granola. It's just oats and honey. Got me some nice sandwich bread from the Artisan or from Love and Fresh. And then I got me some bananas for my acai bowls. And then my cold items are in this bag. My old DoorDash bag, because I used to do DoorDash. And then they banned me, but they sent me this bag. And I still have it. I got some Southwest guacamole. So this wasn't on my list, but it was something I wanted. I got shredded lettuce. Whoops. I got some pink salmon fillets. Some strawberries. These are huge strawberries, by the way. Whoops. And then I got coconut milk to make my pink drinks, the knockoff version of them, strawberry kiwi juice, also for my pink drink, and then my 2% milk. And this was like $28 for all of this, which I feel like is not the worst in the world.
is my lunch. We got our fried chicken, pasta salad, tomatoes, and then this little bubbler sparkling water. I'm gonna try this. This is Tropical Dreamer. That's good. That's really good. Guys, I just showered and I have eight minutes to get ready. So let's pick our outfit. Okay, I'm gonna go with this and leggings. All right, all dressed. I think we're gonna wear this today. All right, and I have to style my hair in about one minute because my five minute alarm just went off. And all we're gonna do for our hair is um, a slick back clip up. If I had prepped properly, I would have been able to just throw my wig back on, but that's okay. I can wear my natural hair out. Sometimes, I just don't wear it out all the time. But yeah. Just do my standard claw clip because that is um, one of the quickest, easiest styles. And then just put on some earrings. <clears throat> and I'm literally good to go. Two thousand years later. Alright guys, I am getting off of work. Yeah! And we're going to try to make it to our Zumba class, which is going to be in about 45 minutes. So I have about 30 minutes to get some stuff done at home. And then I'm gonna have to head out. I am wearing like clothes I can wear to the gym. I just need to like switch my sports bra. It also unfortunately looks like it's gonna be raining soon. It's kind of like it was raining a little bit and then it stopped. It went rain again and then it was stop. And it looked like the power went out at my dad's house at some point. I'm picking right here because I feel like a pimple coming through. Anyways, I got two more packages today, which were two of the last ones two out of the four i still have left so the only packages i have still coming that were from um online orders are shein and then victoria's secret and then after that guys we have not ordered any and i'm not ordering anything else online and we're gonna try to go the rest of this month without spending you know what i think i should just do um someone suggested a 30 day so I guess I just have to start from one day this month since I already kind of didn't do the entire month this month. All right, guys, we're running late to the gym. <sighs> but at least we're going. Alright guys, I'm 
finished at the gym. And now, I think I'm gonna go to Walmart. I feel like I need something. Something I forgot. But I can't remember exactly what I forgot. Ooh, my thing was dirty. Alright. I got a good workout and then I did my hydro massage right after. So that helps recover my sore muscles. And then I don't know what class I'm going to do tomorrow yet. I might just come whenever I get up and not try to do like a specific class. But we'll see how I'm feeling. I just feel like I didn't get to sleep in this week. Like I haven't slept in one day this week. So I would like to sleep in tomorrow since pretty much this whole week I did not what did I do Monday I can't remember why I didn't sleep in on Monday but I just feel like this whole week has been me not getting enough sleep and also doing too much so yeah all right we're about to look in Marshalls for the first time in a long time I just want to see if they got any juicy bags here. All right, I'm on the hunt for juicy bags. Let's see if I get lucky. All right, I am leaving Burlington and I have purchased an e-gift card, right? And the e-gift card wasn't showing like a barcode for me to like check out with it. So I called the customer service people and they're like, oh, it's still processing and we have to escalate it so that you can get your barcode. I was like, well, the store is gonna be closing soon now. So the sooner, the better obviously but I'm about to go to Walmart anyways so hopefully by the time I'm finished at Walmart I'll be able to get the card also guys I love shopping after 9 p.m. places because there's never any traffic. I never have to deal with like long lines in store and it's the most like stress-free shopping. I would say either very, very early in the morning as soon as they open, but I honestly feel like it's busier as soon as they open than it is when you um, go when they're closing or like later at night because most people want to be home by eight but since i had my zumba class tonight and then i went to marshall's first and y'all marshall's i got some really good stuff all on clearance and one of the items is something i've really 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 been wanting so when you guys see it y'all are going to be so shocked and happy and it's an item that's been on like my dream list for me to get for my room and also the item i'm going to walmart for right now is another item i've really really been wanting for a while as well 
y'all why is this lamp so hard slash hidden they have the stitch one if i don't see the hello kitty but i really want wanted the hello kitty one and i don't see it It says it's in stock here, guys. Oh. All right, they said they have it. You had it here, y'all, and it was a lie. So we're gonna try another Walmart. The Walmart I was originally gonna go to, that's close to my house. And then if it's not there, we are just going to call it quits. <gasps> All right, y'all. I just got my e-gift card, so we're about to go back to Burlington, then go to the other Walmart, and then go home. So I should be home by eleven, which is pretty late still. But you know what? I got everything that I needed to get. Burlington over here is still open till midnight. So, it's the perfect place for anyone who enjoys late night shopping, which I do because it's just less people around. And in general, I prefer less people to a lot of people. And hopefully they didn't put all my stuff back and I can just check out and get out of there and then go to Walmart and go home and eat some good food. All I really have to eat, I have my sushi from yesterday that I never ate. We're going to eat that and then I don't know what else I'm going to eat. I had like a kind of big lunch because I made some leftover chicken and then I also had my pasta salad so to be quite honest I'm not like really hungry for a big dinner like that so sushi is probably all I'm gonna get
try to do Instacart though from maybe like 11 to 2 because I have not really worked much this week. Alright guys, I found the layup that they said wasn't there. I'm super happy. Alright, here is a quick Walmart haul. Move you guys over here. I got chili garlic tortilla chips, some flour tortillas, and shrimp. I think I'm gonna make shrimp tacos, guys, tomorrow for dinner. And then I was craving some sweets. I got strawberry shortcake cupcakes plus the Seven Up cream cheese cake bites. Which I don't think I've tried these before, but they look pretty good. Thank you. 